Hello, hello, my dear student. We will start lesson six one, the polygon angle sum theorem. The essential question of this lesson is how does the number of sides in a convex polygon relates to the sum of the measures of the exterior and interior angle? These are the standards that we are following in our lesson. And after we're done with this lesson, you will be able to find the sum of the measure of the interior angles for each polygon. Now let's look at the lesson over view here. We will start looking at example one. The conceptual understanding of example one is to explore polygon interior angle sum. How does the number of sides of a convex polygon and relates to the sum of the measure of the interior angles? So here we can see that we have a triangle. The sum we all know by now that the sum of the angles of a triangle is equal to 180. And then we will look here at the simulation. If I have like four sides, what will happen to the figure? So here we have a pentagon. What happens to the number of sides, how that will apply for different concepts. So we will be discussing different shapes with different angle sum. What is the rule that we have to apply here? In this example, we will discuss the sum of the exterior angles, measures of a convex polygon. Exterior angles are the angles that result from extending one side of a uh, polygon. Each exterior and interior angle pairs form a linear pair, which measures 180. So the sum of the exterior angles for any polygon will always equal 300. 60, we'll prove that in details when we take our lesson together. We will see how does it um, uh, change and how does it differ. The interior angle differs, but the exterior always measure 100 and, uh, sorry, 360. Look at the angles here, regardless for the number of sides here. How many sides? It doesn't make any difference. It's always 360. And by the end, we will have our summary for this lesson. This is a very important lesson that you should know. But once you practice it, always we say that math, math is practice. The more you practice it, the more you get it. We have also the uh, exercise here uh, that we will practice uh, in our classes. You will be given extra worksheet to practice. I hope you all do understand this lesson and understand all of our lessons that we will be covering. Have a pleasant day, everybody.